Sports, and we are at Raymond James Stadium in Tampa, Florida. Coming up, we got a good matchup on tap here as it'll be the New Orleans Saints taking on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Just about set for football. Blake Groupie is ready to get us started. And off we go from Tampa. And no run back here, so they'll bring it out to the 25. Thanks. Baker going to throw this right away. Complete to open things up. Had no command that time, but ended up putting a little too much heat on it, don't you think, partner? Absolutely, just needed a touch more air under it. Instead, he fired an absolute bullet. Another throw on second down, and this one incomplete as well. That's absolutely going to fire this defense up. They made it their mission to deny that completion, and they came through with a nice hit and knocked it incomplete. Pressure comes and down goes Baker Mayfield. Tano Passigno in there to drop him for a six-yard loss, and that will lead to fourth down. And they're indeed going. It's Mayfield airing this one out for Evans. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. So here's a first and 10 now down inside the 20. Hill looks to throw. And this thing is blown up defensively. They will not get a throw off on the trick play. And that'll go down as a sack. A shotgun snap for Hill. Eluding the pressure right. Seven yards on the play. And that'll lead here to a third down. That's an early scramble that can be viewed positively by either side. A point of view, it begins to establish it as a possibility to keep it on certain plays. And defensively, they avoided giving up a huge play in one of their touchdown. Jimmy Graham, a 14 yard touchdown. And the Saints are on the board first here on the road in Tampa. So it takes him just three plays here to find the end zone. And you remember, of course, this was all set up by their defense. Yeah, they got the stop on fourth down. So I imagine the offense said to their defense, thank you very much for this great starting field position. And like you said, three plays later, they're in the end zone. After the touchdown, here's Groupie to kick this one away. Taken at the goal line. And some good special teams coverage as they bring him down just outside of the 15. The Bucks offense set to begin their next possession. Charles, we know that this offense is aggressive. We saw that last drive. They went for it on fourth down, didn't get it. Then they give up the touchdown. So now you feel like they really need to respond here. They certainly do, but let's face it. Sometimes when you take that risk, you understand if you fail, a little more onus goes back on your ball club to try to pick themselves back up. Going for Evans, but that pass is intercepted. Picked off by Marshawn Lattimore. And a tough turnover there as now they will have it at the six-yard line, first and goal. Suddenly it's first and goal after the interception. A quick change in the situation here. Here's Hill now after the interception. Rolling to his left. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, New Orleans. Taysom Hill. A beast in the red zone with his second touchdown of the game. And the Saints are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. And the point after, good by Groupie. And that'll make the score 14 to zip. After the touchdown, here's Groupie to kick this one away. From the end zone, here's Devin Tompkins. And tackled at the 21-yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. The Tampa offense ready to get their drive started. 
They've shown very little offensively to this point. Well, neither team has really. And they come up here now, first down. And got his man complete. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. Mike Evans, 79 yards. And the Buccaneers are able to strike quickly here as they are in for six. Extra point by McLaughlin is up and good. And that'll make our score 14 to seven. Following the touchdown, here's McLaughlin to kick off. And he won't quite make it to the 25. Now Hill looking to throw on first. This to Graham on the short pass. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. Here's Hill. Now third down is looming. A pickup of two on first down and just one yard there. So seven yards for the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. Taken in by his big tight end. And he is going to have a Saints first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Well, sometimes our pregame meetings do pay off, don't they? What did the guys in the locker room call him? Well, they said it with a chuckle. They called him old reliable. Yeah, that means he doesn't move quite as fast as he used to, but he still knows all the tricks, doesn't he? Even that little gentle push off in order to get open. He finds a way to pick up a first down. And he's able to get across midfield and down into Buccaneer territory. Here's Carr to throw. Flush to his right. And that one complete downfield to Johnson. Touchdown, Saints. Juwan Johnson, 45 yards. And the Saints go up by two touchdowns. Boy, still in the first quarter, and look out. I mean, they are on pace for over 80 points in this game. I don't know that they'll get there, CD, but this has been impressive to watch so far. That certainly would be history in the making, wouldn't it, partner? I'm glad we're here to actually watch and see if it actually happens, although, like you, I have my doubts, but they are firmly in control of this game. From a yard or two deep, here comes a return. And he'll wind up getting a couple extra yards here for his trouble to bringing it out of the end zone as he's down at the 27. The Bucks offense set to begin their next possession. First down, Mayfield. And his throw here is incomplete. It certainly didn't appear that that's where he wanted to go with the ball initially, so he tried to get something out of it by dumping it off to his running back unsuccessfully. Deep ball there on second down, but it'll wind up incomplete. Oh, that's some good closing speed there defensively because that looked open for a minute. But that's great work with the ball in the air. Never gave up, converged on his man, and broke the play up. Escaping the pressure right. And they'll get him down at the 34, and he's going to be short of the first by a few yards. A pretty wild first quarter. 21-7, our score. Now the Bucks going to use the first of their timeouts. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. Now the offense failed earlier on the previous crack at this, but they're going again on fourth down. They'll try and throw for it here. And he's brought down. Can't do anything with a football. It's a sack and a turnover on downs. Boy, a curious decision to go for it doesn't pan out, and the Saints are going to get it back and in great shape. They'll fake the handoff. Now Hill rolling to his right. And that one goes incomplete. They tried something out of the bag of tricks, but it's incomplete and now second down. That was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket, I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage. 
But what often happens now with these quarterbacks who can move, defenses want to try and keep bodies in front of them, and I think that discouraged him from taking... And he'll take it into the end zone for the...